Love must be sincere. Hate what is evil. Cling to what is good. Be devoted to one another in love. Honor one another above yourselves. Never be lacking in zeal, but keep your spiritual fervor serving the Lord. It's not the mighty Mississippi, not the sunshine in LA. It's not a snow-capped Rocky Mountain on a warm summer day. It's not the glow of a full moon shining in the night. There's nothing grand about a canyon that holds a candle to your sight. The most beauty that I've seen is you. I just want to say that I see these godly attributes in both Everton and Angela. So what a blessing. I just, my prayer is that you grow in these attributes. You depend on the Lord always for his guidance. You have been sealed with the Holy Spirit. You can hear his still small voice guiding you. And so my blessing on you is that you grow in the knowledge and the revelation of the Lord. Now, before I pronounce your husband and wife, there's one more thing I would like for you to do. As you can see, your wedding day is flying by. And I would like for you to just take a deep breath at this time and look into each other's eyes. I want you to capture this moment. Take a picture of it so that it can register in your heart, in your minds. Someone once said, a dream you dream alone is only a dream. A dream that you dream together, that is reality. Let that new reality start at this moment. So as you have declared your love, your intentions and vows to each other before God and these witnesses, by virtue of the authority vested in me in conformity with the laws of the state of Florida, I now pronounce you husband and wife, Everton, you may now finally, officially, legally, and with much passion, kiss your bride. Yes.
Angela and I are just so um, gratified, so delighted, so happy that you could all come uh, and join in this special celebration with us. Um, you all represent significant parts of our journey at different times in our life and currently in our life. And so for that, we are grateful. We're grateful for your love. We're grateful for your support. We're grateful that you could spend this special time and create these special memories with us. I won't take up any more time because we still want to do a little dancing, but I want to say thank you from the bottom of our hearts and may God bless you and may your journey be safe uh, back home. Thank you. Let's welcome the new bride and groom, Dr. Mr. Everton and Aradell. Thank you.